Come on, let's dive right in. Friend and colleague this week sent over an article about this research. Shout out Double D Turf. Thank you, Dennis. So what's so awesome about this newly uncovered stuff is that it shows exactly how microbes and plants team up and how microbes deliver nutrients to the plant. This is some awesome, non-biased university research that is so foundational to what we do every day in the turf industry. Uh, and the funny thing is, this week isn't actually the first time that I saw this. Two years ago, when it first came out, someone on the Earthworks team shared it amongst the group, uh, which is so cool. And um, I dove into it one inspired afternoon sitting at the conference table at the Earthworks office. and. To better understand it for myself, I really needed to draw it out. And so this is a drawing of what I was reading there. Uh, you can pause the video and check it out because I think it's a pretty good Cliff Notes version of the rhizophagy cycle. Root. Eat. So, Dr. James White of the plant biology department at Rutgers kind of puts it the best way. He says that Plants actively cultivate microbial colonies by feeding them sugars and proteins and vitamins. The plants are actually farming whole colonies of microbes because they take in those microbes and then extract nutrients from the actual microbes within the cells of the plant. A really cool part to me is that the surviving microbes from this really nasty extraction process in the plant, nasty to the microbe, not nasty to the plant, the surviving microbes then exit the plant and as they're leaving the plant, that spurs the plant to grow more root hairs. This stuff is so cool and it's what we at Earthworks just love. And we know that if you're watching these videos, you love it too. So thank you all so much dive in this is some great stuff